Tech Link for Youth is pleased to announce that its board of directors has selected Rick Crossland, scientist in residence, Wayne Township Schools, as a 2016 Bridge Builder Award recipient. Rick, please join me on stage. Thank you very much, Steve. I appreciate that. And uh, this is a pretty amazing night for a uh, fourth grade teacher, I'll tell you. <laughs> uh, it's a wonder, wonderful honor to receive this TechPoint Foundation Youth Bridge Builder Award. You know, technology has always played a huge role in what I do with kids every day. When I think back 40 years ago, I ran the first Netscape class for teachers. <laughs> and uh, 20 minutes into the presentation, the teacher raised her hand. They were kind of embarrassed and asked me, what is a cursor? I realized that, uh, I said, well, why don't you guys go back to your classroom, send me a student. And the next day, within two or three minutes, I had a, a kid in every classroom knew how to do all the technology for the teachers. So I do know the value of students in technology. I also want to thank TechPoint for their sponsor, the sponsors of this award, and for the invitation to this wonderful gala, and for my wife and I to have a great uh, night out here tonight. Uh, you know, it's. Uh, I've always worked with kids, and I'll tell you, the last month when I heard about this, I have not missed an opportunity to say, this is a cool award, but guess who got it last year? The mayor of Indianapolis. <laughs> so that's been a really great, so thank you for letting me to follow in your footsteps, Mayor Ballard. <laughs> yeah. I also would like to thank uh, the, so many people in Wayne Township, and you guys, you guys make this stuff, we use it, but you need to know that one phone number for that one lady or that one man that can fix it since we don't read any of the directions that, how to do these things. And so there's a lot of people in Wayne Township that help me support all my endeavors. Now this grant as a bridge builder award comes with a nice uh, scholarship. And with that, I'm gonna be able to take 20 students with me this summer on our science uh, safari expeditions that I've been doing for a long time. We'll be climbing inside FedEx cargo planes, caves, creeks, and trails all across Indiana. And I know those kids will never have had that experience if they didn't get this sponsorship. And uh, it's gonna be pretty amazing. I can't wait to see the looks on their faces. Uh, things have changed so much. Uh, I'll tell you just uh, briefly, on my bus trips back to school, with the technology we have now, I'm able to look up things out in the field fossils, invertebrates, show the kids, post pictures, write the blog before we're even back to meet the parents. And that is a huge change in technology. I just want to say one more thing, and that's uh, there's probably some students, former students of mine in the audience that have been on some of my trips. I ran into a couple of them. They're a little bit older, a little bit bigger than they were back in third grade. <laughs> Uh, I just want to thank you for helping me grow Indiana's future. Thank you very much. <laughs>